Lionsgate presents a Chris Roberts game. <laughs> In the distant future, mankind is locked in a deadly war. Wing Commander, for the SNES. Let's play by Blue Ankylo, and welcome is one of my favorite old games from my childhood. Very nostalgic. And I'll be here. Let's play it for you. So let's get going. I'm gonna... Let's go with blue. Conveniently, the guy that the main character has blue hair. So main screen, this is the, t the bar, we can fly a training mission, we can talk to Shot Glass, the bartender, got Paladin, he's old vet, got Angel, she's, I think she's the French chick actually, sort of a scoreboard here, we're on the Tiger's Claw, of course, and uh, we're at the bottom, because we're the newbie, uh, I'll talk to everybody first, let's see, let's see what Shot Glass has to say, belly on up friend, and take a load off. You must be blue. I'm Shot Glass. Welcome aboard the Claw. Used to be a pilot myself, till the flea bag shot me up so bad I couldn't fly. I guess I flew with most every pilot on the Claw. So if you want to know how one pilot or another flies, old Shot Glass is the guy to task. Stop by when you're off duty and we'll talk more. He's alright, gives us some nice tips. Paladin. Oh, laddie. Right, he's Scottish. Take a seat and have a chat with old Paladin. I recall once when I was just a lieutenant like yourself there. We were flying patrol over Accord, the fourth planet in the Alliance system. These four Kilrathi Thalfi came zooming in with the sun at their backs. What is the point, monsieur? This is... there is one we? Right, this is French. I was leading up to it, lass. That day we learned that a Thalfi will always turn to the left. It's got something to do with the way your engines and ducks are arranged. So when you tail a selfie, watch to the left. That's where he'll go when he makes his break. I'm not sure if that's true in the game. I, it might be, actually. This is a, a, a port of the original PC version back in DOS. And not everything made it into the SNES version, so I'm not sure. Bonjour, Lieutenant. You are called Blue, no? I am Angel. Angel. I am just reviewing some figures on our recent encounters with the Kilrathi. You would like to know what I have learned, perhaps? The Dralthi is the Kilrathi fighter seen most in this sector. These figures show that 1.4 missiles are required to destroy the Dralthi, while over 7 direct laser hits are necessary to destroy the same vessel. I hope this information is useful to you, Lieutenant. Well, if I ever have 4 tenths of a missile, I'll be sure to use it. So over here, we have uh, the barracks. Now these beds don't do anything on the PC version. You can save on them, but uh, not for the SNES. And here we are. Uh, we don't have a lot of uh, medals or anything, but uh, we're just getting started. So to the briefing room, let's get going. Enyo system. We've got a lot of work to do, people, so let's get to it. The Tiger's Claw dropped from drum space seven hours ago. Eight. Oh, wait, honey. Blue Angel Squadron has first patrol. You killer bees have the next shift. Yeah, hell yeah, killer bees. You rookies will be flying with experienced pilots on your first missions. I want the rookies to fly as wing leaders. You vets keep an eye on the kids out there. Here are the assignments. Blue, you're leading Alpha Wing. Spirit will fly on your wing. She's quiet, but she knows the ropes. You're the wing leader, but if Spirit talks, you be sure and listen. Got it? Yes, sir. Good. Here's your patrol plan, then. Computer display alpha. All right. So this is our mission. Uh, you'll check three possible jump points at about 20,000 clicks out. Uh, huh? There are asteroids near nav two and three. So stay
the encores. Yeah, fly right through them. Thanks, guys. Any questions? Yes, Commander. What are we to do if we encounter the enemy? Engage if the odds look good. Let Blue make the call. Oh, we'll be fighting. No worries. Thoughts wander. And back to the Tiger's Claw. Remember, this is no train sim. If you see the enemy, he'll be out to destroy you. Be sure you do it to him before he does it to you. That's right. Squadron dismissed. Love the music in this game. So we're off to our ship. And our first mission. Here's hoping it goes successfully. Maybe I'll skip a little bit there. Alright. So, this is a light fighter, the Raptor. It's uh, not bad. It's pretty weak. Shields down there and armor are not very good. I'll give you a quick description. We got uh, laser bolts, fairly long range, low damage, but low power. We've got a couple missiles that I can switch between. Javelin heat seekers and darts, dumb fire. They just shoot forward. The heat seekers are a bit better. We've got uh, targeting mode, calm mode. We can tell spirit to keep in formation or not. And while we're on the nav, we can look at our map. We're actually already halfway to nav one, but we can actually change from here, so you don't have to do them in order if you don't want, but uh, we'll stick to it for now. Um, we can also see ship damage, but no damage yet. So anyway, look at that. There's our ships, just in time. So we're actually, uh, let's send her off, and uh, let's get to work. After burning towards it. I guess that one's fine. Let's get him. Just out of range. Oh. I think these lasers are the only one that can actually hit them when they're doing that. Just hovering away from you. Yeah, that's how we do it. Who's next? Oh, Spirit's helping. When I say help, I uh, use the term lightning. Come on, let's engage. Come on. Friendly fire is also on, if you're wondering. Oh, a head-on collision. Ouch. The uh, computer likes to do that. Ramming speed. Here are firing missiles and stuff. Yeah, these, these guys aren't engaging. Come on, guys. Let's uh, taunt him. Here, kitty, kitty. And he just says that. Hey! Came at me. Sometimes the taunt works. Come on. Ooh, almost got him. Ah, she stole my kill. Kill thief. Alright, so, uh, apparently we hit nav 1, I think. Let's check here quick. Yeah, we got there while we were fighting, I guess. So on to nav 2. Now this is asteroids. I hate asteroids, so... Autopilot our way closer, please. Uh, nice little animation there. Not quite as cool as the PC version, but it's all good. It's all good. So, asteroids. Uh, try not to get hit. I think... I usually try to stick to about 250 while I'm flying through these things. Seems to, to give me enough time. I probably could go a little bit faster, but, uh, you know, one hit and it's game over, so... You can also blow them up if you shoot them with your blasters, but I don't really recommend that. Uh, they don't always blow up, and sometimes they won't leave you enough time to move out of the way. Anyway, yeah, that, you know... Not the best way to get through an asteroid field. Just gotta get to our nav point. Almost there. I definitely would say asteroids are, and mines are my least favorite part of this game. Um, and probably for this let's play, they're gonna slow it down a bit. So I might, might have to cut these sections out later on, but first mission I'll show them anyway. Should be okay. But, uh, 
kind of can see how I'm doing this. Most of them on the screen don't actually uh, hurt you or nothing. There's always one at a time that uh, sort of heads directly towards you. And you just gotta keep out of watching out for that one. The PC version is a little bit different. I think it can handle more objects at once. So there we go, we're, we're out, of the, out of the field, so on to Nav 3. See how this goes. So we killed some Dralthi, the saucer guys. They were the medium fighters. And now some Southy. Although I better tell her to go attack. She's got a lot of missiles. I'd like to know where she buys her missiles from. We get uh, one heat seeker. She has seemingly unlimited. I'm sure, there's a way to change my target. This game has some pretty ridiculous controls. Uh, hold and select and click the buttons all the time, trying to get your ship to do what you want. Oh yeah, look at that. Go home. Oops. Alright. So, I got lots of missiles left. <laughs> yep. Oh, that's a missile lock. But, uh, no big deal. That's what that sound was. Uh, once there's a missile lock on you, you can usually afterburn your way and, and avoid it if you're quick enough, but uh, not always. Sometimes they get you. So that should be, yeah, another asteroids. Hooray. Uh, try not to get exploded on my first mission. Yeah, this part, uh, not so fun. I'll, I'll probably cut these out next time. That's can't see. Oh yeah, there we go. So, now it's the happy home music. Uh, these missions, you can uh, fail them and go back to base early, uh, or damage yourself enough and go back early, and you can f complete them kind of with a fail, and uh, as you go through the game, if you fail, depending on whether you fail or win, you actually get different missions. You go to different uh, sectors, and uh, if you fail enough, you'll get, I believe, an unwinnable mission. And uh, although you, they send you out, I don't think there's any way to actually complete it. So we're, we're hopefully not going to go down that route. So, so far we're doing okay. We're on the success for the first one, I believe. Usually the success, you just have to hit all your nav points, save the ships if you're transporting, or destroy your targets. You know, it's, it's pretty straightforward. Uh, let's see as we get along. Um, all right, we're out of that. So, back to base. Close up for this episode of this Let's Play. Here we are. That's our Tiger's Claw there. And oops, no, no, not her. Yeah, she can quiet, sure. Uh, yeah, I gotta get hand all these controls again. Request landing. You are clear to land. Thank you. This is also a lot cooler animation on the PC version, I know that for sure. Looks like it got a little hot out there. That, you know, shows how much damage you took. Uh, I've been a lot worse than a little hot. That's pretty light damage. <laughs> Mission debriefing, all six hours, all 600. Welcome back, Blue. Looks like you survived your first trip out. He is a very able pilot, Commander. It is an honor to fly on his wing. That's high praise coming from spirit. You should be proud, Blue. In any case, according to your flight recorder, you flew well out there. Let's go over the mission report. You got three of the hairballs, Blue, and two killer off for spirit. Yeah, kill thief. That's all then. Dismissed. So, there we have it. That will be the end of episode one of my Let's Play. Thank you for watching, and I uh, hope to see you again on the next episode of Let's Play Wing Commander for the SNES.